Good morning and welcome back. Today we are in section 5 and we are going to start with a game. We are going to play Sentence Craft. Do you remember? You will need a pencil and the Sentence Craft scorecard. Your homeroom teachers should have given you the worksheet. If you do not have a worksheet, you can use a blank piece of paper or print a worksheet from the link below. How to play. Teacher will show you boxes. Your job is to make a sentence. You will start with the box on the left. Then pick a box from the next column. Then pick a word from the next column. When you are finished, make sure to write your punctuation mark. Your point values are at the top. What are the symbols? Fire means you are out, zero points. An axe means you are safe, you can earn points. The wood is plus one point. The stone, three points. Gold, five points. And the creeper is minus one point. Example. Teacher is going to pick one box from each column. Let's go swimming and then I will write my period. On my worksheet, I will write the sentence. Then I will show the symbols. How many points will you get? On the worksheet, I will circle plus or minus and then write the number. Are you ready? Let's go. Number one. Pause now to write your sentence. Okay, let's see how many points you get. Number two. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Number three. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Number four. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Number five. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Number six. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Number seven. You need to write a question and an answer. Pause now to write. Let's check our points. Number eight. 
Number eight. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Number nine. Last one. Pause now to write your answer. Let's check our points. Great job! Now open your textbooks. We are in pages 104 and 105. Let's listen to project time. Project time A. Read to write. How was your summer? Hi, Juho. I'm traveling with my family. Now I'm in Gyeongju. Today I saw Chumsung Day. I went to a museum too. It was great. How was your trip? Your friend Leah. One more time. How was your summer? Hi, Juho. I'm traveling with my family. Now I'm in Gyeongju. Today I saw Chumsung Day. I went to a museum too. It was great. How was your trip? Your friend Leah. Let's answer a question about the postcard. Read the sentences, then check the correct sentence. Pause now to answer. What sentence is correct? Number one, number two, or number three? It's number one. Now, close your books. It's project time. Today, you are going to make a summer vacation postcard. Your homeroom teacher should have given you this worksheet. If not, you can print the worksheet from the link below. You are going to write a postcard to your friend or someone you like. Using complete sentences, you are going to write where you traveled to, which can be Seoul, Jeju, your grandparents' house, the museum, your friend's house, anywhere you did go. Then, you are going to write what you did there. Took many pictures, ate pizza, played soccer, anything. Remember, use past tense verbs. Use complete sentences, no Korean, and make it colorful. Make it pretty. When you are finished, show teacher your postcard at school for candy. That's the end of Section 5. I will see you next time for Section 6. Bye!